long, long time ago, in the ancient time, all civilizations built amazing things. Seven of them became the wonders of the world. Sadly, six of them have been destroyed. The places where they've been built today are Egypt, Turkey, and Greece. But in my world, all seven of them are still available to be seen. Okay, something strange here. I told you seven wonders of the ancient world were in Greece, Egypt, and Turkey. But the hanging gardens of Babylon were in Babylon. But Babylon today is Iraq. Why did I then put it on the map? Because no one is 100% that the hanging gardens existed. They didn't found not one piece of the hanging gardens, no one. So they don't know where it could be. There is no physical proof, but there is legends and stories. From those stories and legends, we know that the king of Babylon, he built these gardens for his wife about 600 years before our era. He built it because her, his wife missed all the greens and those stuff in her country. She was living before in Medi, but now she moved to Babylon. But Babylon was dry and desert and sand climate, literally. So the king built for his wife these hanging gardens. They were like a seven terraces, but each garden had waterfalls, trees, bushes, flowers, butterflies, um, I don't know, um, anything what you could find in a park. They used very fancy technology to do this. They had to separate the water and the ground with the roof because the trees grew on the roof of the terraces. So they even made a pipe to pull the closest water from the closest river to make the plants grow because of the technology and because of the contrast very dry climate and very grassy climate that's why the hanging gardens of babylon become the seven wonders of the world so these are the hanging gardens of babylon no one knows how they actually looked like so i'm not gonna be telling how did it actually look like i'm just gonna say how i built it so guys please don't complain if i did something wrong because if you complain it will probably not be true so let's just go into it i'm just gonna first show you the outside so you can see we've got this giant tropical tree some lily pads and we've got this wall of flora here and there and then when we go in here you can see that we've got our first one so let's just start from the inside so this is probably the relaxing area you can see all the hanging glowstone they probably didn't have glowstone because glowstone doesn't exist in real life i just used it you can see all of the flowers my favorite flower in minecraft this little cute yellow guy there's a small pond what you can chill out in wait so now we're gonna go into the second one so let's go inside you can see there's this viney um doorway and you can see here the floor wall let's just start from the inside and then we'll go to the inside of the inside you can walk in here in this part here you could just chill see here it's like only my half of my legs are under water the same over there sorry guys like over there and the next one right there you just want to come down this you can sit on the grass put your legs in the water and chill but if you want to go a little bit for a swim in the water. because if you can see here look how deep it is Yep, it's higher than my belly button. So this is the river for swimming. It's having a small walk in the water. Okay, and you can see it's like big pond over here, right there. So we go to our little part. We'll go here to this small part to this next part. 
can see we've got big flowers here. If you're not sure where we are, we are in this part of the hanging gardens. So you can see there's a little water that's flowing down here. There's a little entrance. Maybe you just for frogs walk to. And you can see we have a little hill with a giant pond. So this is probably the chillax area where and uh, the queen and her friend and with chillax and I build a hole well on top here on purpose just so like the waterfall and if you realize here the hanging gardens are still going higher you can see the vines hanging down some people would probably just stand here and just jump into the water and you can see here we a little underground area like a little cave where you could think somebody would be sitting right there and we, you could talk, drink and those stuff and I guess this is the end of this room so if you know there's a hole on the top so you can go to the higher level to the party like I don't know somebody would party up here maybe but now we will see this one. Oh, by the way, you can see there's palms on these two ones. There's two palms. I'm gonna leave it there so you can see. Okay, so now we'll go to this one. But we're not gonna go straight through the pillars. We're gonna actually go and use the stairs to get up there. So we'll start from this one. From the main one. We'll go up here. And you would probably thinking, why are these stairs here? We will go up here now to the higher level. We will go across here. And now we've got this one, what I was talking about. And here's the palm. So here is like the vine area where you could just chill, talk, somebody would be probably sitting here if they like climbing. Yep, that's the place. You can see there's like tables, like weird tables what they added. We could just put the drink right there. Maybe there could be fountains, I don't know. I just add these for decoration. You can see there is like vines on the roof. And that's it in this one so here is the gallery but because maybe some people they would paint so probably this would be the king and that the queen I don't know we've got a lovely picture yep lovely and we've got one big flower over and that's it for the small one and you can just see this is just vines outside so the last one on this level is this one. This is the queen's area. Inside is the queen's area. No one can get in there. Even the king maybe. Even me. Even people. Some kind of maybe magic spell. I don't know what is in there. She's keeping a special probably item in there. Plants maybe. Or maybe some giant flower what she likes. Or maybe this is her relax area. What is like, I don't know, there's probably like, what, like a gold, maybe a magic book? I don't know. Maybe secret treasure room? I don't know. But if you would like to at least make some use of this room, sit down here. Sit down and watch the moon and stars. This is the viewpoint. She can watch all of her um, servants and stuff from above, boats sailing, down. and here, and there's one last room, that small one. Where is the queen's choir room? If we come inside, you can see, this is her sofa, she would sit down here, take a book, read it, you can see there's loads of books, same in this one. You can see there's a waterfall on the back, and there's her favorite book, what she's probably reading. And there's vines on the walls. Sorry for But if she wants to call everybody, 
sit down probably here try not to fall and say greetings everybody or something something i don't know that's all of the hanging garden this is the last video sadly we've done every single video and please subscribe if you didn't yet leave a like and this is all of that ten wonders we've done all of this and that was the end of this series probably soon i'll do more projects it doesn't have to be even ancient maybe i'm gonna do the new seven wonders like maybe there would be a wall of china going blocking like a giant wall on here we'll see so bye